Good morning guys. So today is day four of our trip and mom and I are headed out. What? It's day four already? Yep. We are headed out to brunch. It is Saturday and it's about 1040 right now. Emily is off hanging out with a couple of friends. So I'm taking mom to brunch over at Wynn. We are going to La Cave. La Cave? La Cave? <laughs> I don't know how you pronounce it, but we'll see you guys at the Wynn. <laughs> Good morning guys. So we are here at the Wynn. We are going to brunch at La Cave. La Cave. I don't know how you pronounce it, but we're gonna ask because I'm curious now. I feel like it's gotta be something fancy, right? Anyways, it's about 11 o'clock, so we're just heading over to brunch. Very excited. This place has been on my list for a little while now, and uh, the menu looks really good. It's uh, all you can eat for a set price, but not buffet. It's actually butler pass type of tray pass, is I guess the best way to put it. Um, but I will show you guys that when we get there. We're just heading over now. So I will see you in just a minute. La Cave is located inside of the Wynn Resort and is open daily for dinner. However, on the weekends, they offer a brunch menu that we were dying to try out. For just $55 per person, you are invited to an all-you-can-eat style brunch where servers come around with trays of various menu items for you to try. The restaurant is on the smaller side with a quaint indoor dining area as well as a beautiful enclosed patio. The service was five stars all the way around as our server was very attentive and the food items came around quickly and frequently so we never had an empty plate for long. There were too many items to individually review each one, but here's a little snippet of the various items we got to enjoy. Leave me a comment down below if you've been to La Cobb's brunch, and if so, what items did you enjoy the most? Just got done with brunch, so what did you think, Mom? It was fabulous. For $54, you could have eaten for the entire day, and every single, what, thing, food? Item. Item. Every single item was delicious, especially the short rib hash and the stickers pancake. Those I thought were the best. And surprisingly, the yogurt was delicious. Vanilla yogurt was so vanilla-y, I, I don't usually like yogurt, but boy, it was good. I agree. I think for considering the prices of things here in Vegas, 54 bucks is a deal. Um, you also, if you are a drinker, you, for 35 bucks, you can actually do all you can drink. They have a bottomless brunch, which they had some really good looking beverages. Um, so, you know, if you're a drinker, that's definitely something I think you should do. But I think brunch at La Cave or La Cave was amazing. Okay. I think no, he like said he said La Cave. Who did? The server. La Cave. He said La Cave. Okay. I don't know, guys. Leave us a comment and let us know. Would you pronounce it La Cave or La Cave? I vote La Cave. Oh, because La is French. So maybe you pronounce Cave Cave in French. Lecave. I don't know. If you speak French, let us know. My favorite things were the, uh, actually the tater tots. They tasted like McDonald's hash browns. And that's like a good thing. Oh, oh, that's okay. Um, yeah. I love McDonald's hash browns, obviously. Obviously. And what else did I like? Oh, the, and the, uh, the Oh, the filet. 
The filet Benedict was that was really good. really good. But don't eat the whole uh, muffin. Yeah, you don't need the muffin, but the filet and the egg part was really good. Really good. But, and as was the Angus. Yeah. I mean, literally everything we had was good. It was. So you can't go wrong. Oh, and the cornflake French, uh, French toast. Oh, if I could only learn how to make that. I'm oh, sure you could. Why you have to have the cornflakes. True. Sure. They don't really have any food in their house. <laughs> But I think it's really neat. It's uh, tray past style. So it's kind of like dim sum. They come around and then they offer you individual portions. The portions are small, they're individual size, which is perfect. You can get as many as you want of everything. And we did share the short rib hash. Yeah. And then mom got a second one. Second. She really liked that one. But overall, I think for 54 bucks, definitely come to win, check it out. And now we are gonna walk down the strip. We're gonna head over to Casino Royale because uh, they have a promo where if you play $20, they'll give you $20 in free play. So we're gonna go play a little slots with mom. We'll let you know. Yeah, we'll see you guys over there. So mom and I are here inside of Casino Royale. We just signed up for our players, car players card. Let me show you. So we play $20 in cash. And when you lose the $20, they put $20 of free play on your card that you can then use um, that's on them. So it's kind of cool. Um, the casino here is small, but I actually really like the atmosphere in here. I don't know. It just has like kind of an older vibe to it, uh, older Vegas vibe. So I kind of like that. So we are gonna walk around. <laughs> There's a bunch of mirrors in here. So it's kind of like a, it's almost like a house of, a house of mirrors. <laughs> Cause we're looking at these machines. So we're look, mom's looking at these machines that are in the mirror over here. And she's trying to figure out where those machines are. So, <laughs> oh, they're right here. Okay. <laughs> All right, I think mom found what she wants to play. So let's go ahead and we'll put 20 bucks in and see if we can win. It's getting hot here. All right, we are gonna play this uh, Hot Stuff Wicked Wheel. We'll see you guys if we get bonuses. Okay, so mom got the bonus. Huh? No, touch, you can touch him. Come on, we want to get a blue one. Aw, $2. At least you got a bonus. Mom's getting something. She got a bunch of sevens for six bucks. All right. All right, we'll see you guys at the next bonus. All right, guys. Mom got the bonus. Yeah, we want our cows back.
on a 40 or 60 cent bet guys that's pretty good i won 25 dollars and 40 cents for five cents of this car all right guys we are just leaving casino royale we're heading our making our way back to aria but that was a lot of fun the promo is really it's cool you can use it i think once a year um yeah, so if you haven't been there in over a year, go back and see if you can use that promo because I think that's worth it. Um, I lost my money. I, I didn't win anything, but mom did well. She actually came out ahead $5. So definitely worth playing over there for that promo. And now we're just going to go back to Aria. We're going to rest up a little bit and then we will see you guys at the hotel. Okay, change of plans. <laughs> uh, we're passing by the Mirage and I wanted to go in there because it's now a hard rock property and I've been told that they are doing tier matching. Um, so I'm gold with MGM rewards. So I want to find out if I can match to hard rock. I don't usually stay, I don't think I've ever actually stayed in a hard rock hotel, but maybe I'll run a couple, like a 20 or something through the machines just to see if they send some kind of offers. So let's go in and check it out. All right, guys, we're here at the Mirage and I just got my tier match done. If you're gold with MGM, you end up getting to be Icon with, cover my number, Icon with Hard Rock or Unity. And you get some points, which you can turn into free play. You either get $100 in food and beverage credit or I chose to do $57 in free play. Mom is gonna do uh, some money in this too. And um, we'll see if we get a bonus. All right, mom got the beyond the wall bonus. So let's see, hopefully she hits something good.
bummer on that one. Okay, we got a match. Good. We really want that two times to land next one. <laughs> okay, last level. Last level. Come on, land one. How amazing would it be to land the 50 times two? Ooh, you got that one. Come on, John, do it, do it. One time, do it. John. Please. John, one time. One time for the video, John. Oh, we got him. Okay. Well, at least we got an extra 20 bucks. That was good. Not bad for 75 cents. Ah, oh, of course not. Still 30 bucks though. All right, let's cash out. All right. We're gonna go cash out and play my free play. So mom is now ahead. She loves this game. All right, we'll see you guys in a bit. Yeah. All right guys, I did not get anything on my free play as far as bonuses, so there was nothing to show you, but I did cash out at $40 and 64 cents. So we're gonna cash this out and head back to Aria. We will see you back at the hotel. Three hours later. All right, guys. So we are here at Jen Korean Barbecue for dinner. This is in the Planet Hollywood Miracle Mile shops. Um, it's right off of I think this is Harmon on over on this side. But if you come in through the main entrance of, to the shops on um, on the strip, you basically come in and turn right, and it's down this hallway. So very excited. It's an all you can eat. It's thirty five ninety five I think. So I'll show you all the menus and the items, but. For on the strip, the prices are really reasonable. We actually have a bunch of these in Arizona and I really like them. So I'm excited to show you guys all of the food that we get. Now I think this kimchi is gonna be various degrees of spicy. These have lots of chili on them, so I'll start with this one. Sweet and spicy. I think this will be very spicy. Lots of chili. Very spicy. Very, very spicy. I don't know what this is. Just pickled, not spicy. And my favorite, mashed potatoes with corn, not spicy. Very sweet.
so we just got done with dinner and I thought it was fabulous. <laughs> She's obviously quite excited about that. Um, but for $36 a person, that's hard to beat for all you can eat. The, the meats were amazing quality. Beef bulgogi, definitely get that. The filet was good too. I, I, get the I don't think so either. I didn't Enjoy. really. Yeah. And don't I, get the shrimp if you mind the kids on the shrimp. Yeah, we got an order of shrimp, but we didn't know it wasn't peeled or deveined or beheaded. Um, so they come whole. So that didn't go over as well as we had thought. Um, if you don't mind that, then sure, get the shrimp. Uh, but they have all kinds of things. The sushi was really good. I could only get one roll, obviously, because I could only eat one roll. Um, the tuna sushi is fabulous. Yeah, just overall, I mean, the quality of that place is incredible. So I don't know how they're making money on it. <laughs> That's a good question. I don't know how they make money, but if you are going with a group, it's definitely worth it. You guys can get a bunch of things and share. I mean, it's just, it's an awesome place. Highly, highly, highly recommend it. 10 stars all the way around for me. Yeah, I mean, one of those rolls in another restaurant, the sushi roll alone would be $36. Yeah, exactly. And they had good quality, like good assortment of rolls. None that mom would eat, but they had like spicy tuna. They had like salmon ones. There was, I would eat all of the rolls, honestly. But um, I mean, for 36 bucks, the fact that you could get one of each roll if you wanted is amazing. Because you go anywhere else on the script for sushi and it's $30 for one roll, which is ridiculous. But yeah highly recommend check out jen korean barbecue here in the miracle mile shops i'll leave their information down below um, but now we are going to head back to the room and just relax and let my uh stomach digest because i am stuffed that's two stuffed meals today. yeah so we will uh see you guys yeah, we'll see you guys back at the room for a little bit of a recap So we are back in the room. We had a really fun day today. What was your favorite part? Dinner. Yeah. <laughs> I think dinner was my favorite part too. It was really good. And Although, also that I won in two different casinos. Yeah, mom had better luck than me. I didn't win Not diddly tonight, squat. Tonight, <laughs> but mom did good earlier. Maybe but, tomorrow. Um, yeah, tomorrow we are going to be going to two other restaurants or and then we'll show you guys and Tomorrow's a big gambling day, so lots of gambling for the channel on my on my end at least. Um, but thank you guys for watching today's vlog. And anything else to add? And welcome back to your blogging. Yes, welcome back. Thank you guys for those of you who have sent me messages, and I appreciate it. And we're traveling a lot. Yep. So we'll see you guys for tomorrow. Yes.